Yo, what is up, you guys? Welcome back to another West Coast Collector exclusive video. Uh, thank you guys for tuning in. Super excited for today. Uh, today I'm wearing my uh, grills. I collimated a grills shirt. It's definitely an amazing shirt. It's uh, something unique, something that uh, I don't think that I know of any other brand has done. Maybe they have, maybe they haven't. But basically what they did was they took a photo shoot of different people with grills and slapped, <clears throat> and slapped it on a shirt. Definitely one of my favorite shirts. Uh, this is considered uh, top. Probably my favorite. Is my, probably my second favorite. My first favorite now is the Summer Assassin. That's my number one shirt. This is definitely my. Either, it used to be my first. But this is an amazing shirt. Something that I consider art. It's something you don't see anywhere, and uh, catches people's eyes. Uh, I'm a big uh, button-up shirt collector. I love funky sh stuff like this. Um, Today's CD feature, uh, I chose Miss Yelly. The reason why I chose Miss Yelly is because she likes wearing funky shirts like these colorways that you don't see in many people and that often, uh, stuff like that, and uh, this is why the reason why I chose her. Uh, today's CD album is uh, her Under Construction album, definitely a classic right here. Uh, love this album, definitely a banger. Uh, a lot of good songs off of this album. Uh, my favorite one, probably Work It, which is the one that's right here. Classic Folks is pretty good. Uh, Hot. So many good songs up in this, man. This is a classic, classic CD. Sadly, it is broken. Here is the inside, which is definitely, definitely badass. Sheesh. I think that's Timberland. Definitely, definitely an amazing uh, out artist. She, to me, is my favorite female rapper, MC, artist, whatever you want to say, or call her. To me, she is a queen. She's the number one artist of all time that's female-wise. No one will ever talk to her. <clears throat> definitely cool. Uh, it took forever for this package to get here. If I'm not mistaken, this is the water uh, splash shirt. Uh, found it on uh, Poshmark. Uh, came across it a long time ago. Anything to cut this with? Have to use my finger. So I came across this a long time ago on Poshmark. At the time, super expensive. It was like forty bucks. I'm not gonna spend forty bucks on a shirt, no matter what it is. There is on Max. Uh, definitely cool shirt. Uh, I had to get it because I've never seen it before. I never came across it before. And uh, I finally found one that was in my size. Uh, I got it for like 13 bucks. Plus like, I think it was like 7 in shipping. No, it was like 4 in shipping. So it ended up being like 17 bucks in total. Which is not bad. Because uh, the guy had... When I came back to it a couple months later, that's when I found out that it had lowered the price, which was good. <clears throat> what we got a note here? Okay. Thank you for your purchase. You are my first cust customer. I just started listing that day and have many more affordable, similar items. I have lots of... I've had lots of luck. eBay, however, is higher. I... I... Try at Poshmark, check out my other items, and let's make some deals. My store. Uh, Brian, holy Brian H. God bless. Great items, great prices. Definitely, uh, I'm going to link your store down below, homie. Uh, definitely cool. Uh, I know he has another shirt, which I will probably going to try to now uh, try to kind of like uh, negotiate for. Because it's a shirt that I do have, but, you know, different colorway. And uh, we'll see if I'm going to get it or not. This is the shirt. Whoa. This looks in a... It'll just stain right there. Uh, I've been using the OxyClean stain remover. Works like a charm. Definitely an amazing shirt. I mean, uh, stain remover, so I'll be definitely using that on this. Makes white even more white. Man, this shirt... Wow, this is something else. I've, I've never seen this before. I didn't know this until recently. Uh... Oh, I've never seen a couple pictures, and that was it. Uh, 
I was finally able to find one. I know all these years I collected on eBay, I've never seen this uh, for sale. If they were, they probably weren't my size. But look at this, man. This is just uh, amazing. Let me scratch my leg, man. I got itch. I got bit by a fucking mosquito the other day, and so I've been itchy. Uh, definitely cool. Look at this, man. This is like it's like slash everywhere. It's something you don't see anywhere, man. This is shit that I like that catches people's eyes and catches them off guard. So, from what I know, my understanding from a fellow Echo collector, I was told who owned this, by the way, back in the day. That there is a set of shorts that go with this. Man, look at this. This is, this is kind of like what you would take to like a playa or like the beach. For all my non-Mexican, um, non-Spanish speaking folks. It's amazing. Look at this, man. The detail to this is like, oof, fire. The condition of this looks amazing. Then it says Echo Summer 2000. So I'm assuming that's when this was released. So can get a better there we go and it's like the, the sand this this is amazing I'm glad to have this in my collection I am trying to get most if not all button up echo shirts by complex or whatever other you know button ups they release so here is the inside Man, in 72, 100% polyester, double needled construction, 2XL, made in Korea. That's wild. In the back, you got the little Echo logo right there. Man, this is like next level shit, you know? The, oh yeah, this is what I like to see most. The, the pouch, the little, you know, a hole here. Each, everyone is different. This one is stitched. Sometimes it's just like has a little plastic feel to it, like a little rubbery feel to it. But this one is stitched on. Uh, sometimes they have like a secret pouch on the on the the, sh uh, the sleeve. This one does not look like it has it. Uh, definitely cool, definitely badass. Uh, like I said, I'm definitely gonna put in that little white powder, you know, stain remover from Moxiclean Versatile Stain Remover. Highly recommend it. Works like a charm. Uh, as you can see, it's a little stained on the the little collar. Uh, definitely will get that. Should get it off. Usually, what that product does, you soak it in a tub of water. You put the product in, mix it, make sure it's dissolved. The water usually turns white. You put it in there, and I usually tend to leave it. I usually tend to do that before I go to work, like eight hours. Just leave it in there. Works like a charm. What I like about it does not fuck up the paint like if it's colors like if it's like even black black should work i haven't tried it yet so you know don't take my word for it but you know i'm pretty sure it should work uh usually remove stains like a charm uh so far of all the shirts that i've had stains with i i don't have stains for a long time that i could not remove i put them in there removes it like a charm there's only one stain that I could not remove don't know what it is it's black so it could be you know grease or some shit and Something that's really thick. But other than that, it's, it has the room stains pretty good, so it should make this crisp clean and white. Uh, so, yeah. Thank you guys for tuning in for today's video. A little quickie. Uh, I'm really excited for this. I have another shirt coming in that is also uh, buttoned up. Excited to uh, get my uh, shirt game up. Start, start to uh, <clears throat> expand my collection a little bit more. Because uh, I love collecting these weird, funky, you know... I call them shirts that make you catch your eye. You know, you're walking down the street. Like, what is he wearing? Damn, you know? Like a walking canvas. So, yeah, definitely. I uh, appreciate you guys. Let me know down below what you think. If you had this before, if you own one, let me know down below. Uh, definitely cool. Uh, would you ever wear something like this? Let me know. If you wouldn't, let me know why. Is it strange, weird for you, or... Or uh, would you prefer something like this, which I do prefer more, but that's still cool. That's something I still want to wear. Uh, I feel like that's perfect for, like, summer, you know, when it's hot. Take it to the beach or some shit like that. You'll be fired. You'll be willing to do much shit. So, yeah. 
Uh, thank you guys for uh, sticking by. Uh, like the video, please. I mean a lot. And uh, I'll be seeing you guys soon. And uh, peace. Yay! Somebody asked me last video about that. Yay! Uh, that is a uh, Bay Area term that, not really a term, more like a saying, what people say. Yee! If you look at uh, some Bay Area music, you hear it a lot, especially with Mac Gray. Uh, he says it a lot, so, you know, I'm, I'm close to the Bay, I'm not in the Bay, I'm close to the Bay. Like two hours, maybe probably less. Uh, like, yeah, I'm probably like two hours away from the Bay, so, you know, it's not that far. And a lot of the music I like, and, you know, it kind of like stuck to me like gum, so, you know, I have a little bear in me, yee, and I'll see you guys on next.